Hello YouTubers. Here is a simple project we are going to do today. This is what is we are going to create a night lamp for our room. Uh, as you know, uh, such a project is very very much easy. But if you don't know about uh, these things, you will go to purchase a night lamp for your room and then the uh, lamp could be an incandescent lamp or an LED type. But anyhow, it will take some power and maybe it will consume more power and of course it will have some cost it will have some price for you and uh, that will be a budget uh, for you so this is a budget project a very cheap project what i'm going to do and I, what i'm going to share with you the idea the idea maybe some people before also uh, shared on internet but here i'm going to do it practically in front of you so here is what is the power supply for a mobile charger in my hand uh, this is you know the cable had been broken and somebody had been given this to me um, these are some 5 volt what it is written is over here 200 to 240 volt input and uh, 5 volt and 450 milliampere the output the output can be anything up to 50 uh, from 50 milliampere it could do even but this is more than enough for this project uh, so what we will do is the idea is we will take some four LEDs uh, one switch and two resistors these resistors uh, you can use even a single resistor of a little bit more uh, wattage uh, but what I have is uh, 270 ohms uh, two resistors I am using mm, so these resistance will be enough for uh, uh, such a project and here is what I'm doing is I will fix these LEDs over here or here or somewhere where I will find the place and uh, in series I will put these resistors uh, and this switch so the purpose of the switch is we I can be I will be able to switch this uh, lamp this night lamp in two colors maybe I will use green and blue uh, sorry green and uh, red or red and blue or whatever kind of kind of color you want you can use so here uh, LED of course you can see this is a special a bright color LED and uh, it's glowing with very little current and of course this project will consume very little current mm, so this one mm, the LED have two legs as you know the shorter one that's normally negative and the longer one is normally the positive the other uh, inside as one of my friend very nice friend he had indicated on the internet and also this is known to you people that where the cap is as you can see this is the cap and this small is Right there so the smaller one is positive which is inside not the leg so, so the leg of it the smaller terminal in inside the, that is the positive and the cap which is bigger inside that is shorter that is negative mm, or cathode so this is what is LED uh, so we are going to create this project but first we will do a little bit uh, arithmetic for this one so what we are going to do is we are creating something like that 5 volt 5 volt will come over here and then from 5 volt uh, there will be two resistors in parallel 270 ohms each 270 ohm and 270 ohm so then there will be an LED which will be something like that and then two arrows we will make it for the LED so what it will be is if we are going to check the current for this device which we are going to prepare uh, here is my calculator so what I'm going to do is simply 270 I will divide by 2 divide by 2 so it is 135 ohm so single 135 ohm will be the resistance with a series in the series of this LED and 5 volt will be our supply so if we say that the LED is shorted like this we are not considering this LED now for our calculations and we actually there will be two LEDs in parallel so it will be something like that in reality what we are going to create okay so if this is a short circuit so what it will be the formula is uh, I is equal to V divided by R V over R so the formula according to the formula if we will see like this that uh, v divided by r is 5 divided by 135 so it is coming as uh, 0 0.037 so something 37 milliampere 37 milliampere for both leds two leds so if we will make it for one led so we will divide it by two so it will come something 18 milliampere so 18 milliampere 
per LED which is a very reasonable current uh, for this project. So this thing we will do and now we are going to make our project. What we will do is uh, first I will have to check this one uh, whether it is good or not using my multimeter what I will do is I will check the voltage as the wires are exposed for this one if for your one wires are not exposed so you can open it and check it but for me it is opened so using my voltmeter I am going to check the voltage over here and the polarity also I will know so 5.5 volt this is the voltage and of course this upper one is a positive and this lower one is a negative so this is and this is good as you all know so I will make uh, some holes for LEDs over here and also uh, I cut uh, two three holes sorry three holes I will make for this switch so this, the purpose of the switch will be uh, to uh, change the color of the LED so first we will do is one other experiment we can make by soldering this resistor in series with the LED what we can do is we can glow it, glow it actually so something like that if I will glow it in front of camera you will be able to see it and then I will make it later on so the negative will be downside the resistor side and the other one will be positive so something like that and it is glowing as red as you can see it's glowing red so this thing this will be these two LEDs red two LEDs and our red uh, green two LEDs will be enough to light up a room in the night so this is I will make it and then later on I will show you show it to you hope you understood what I am going to do here is this power supply uh, this is from this case just come come off sorry from this case it just come off came off and uh, here you can see uh, just I made this thing uh, two LEDs here two LEDs here there is a switch and here is my connections the negative wire which is coming from the power supply this black wire you can see it is going to this uh, junction of the two LEDs which are the center points here is the center point of course of this LED uh, these two LEDs and here is the center point of these two LEDs uh, this is grounded the ground the positive wire which is this white wire which is going to the resistors two resistors in parallel and which is going to the switch midpoint and switch one side is connected to this wire switch other point is connected to this wire and these wires are going of course to the two side leds and nodes are positives so here i'm going to put this in to the cover uh, so this uh, casing so it is something like that and it will make its 220 volt connection inside and then outer side as you can see it was same like this I will put some glue a drop of glue two drops of glue it will do so it will be fixed something like that as you can see there is a wiring inside so that's why it's making a little bit difficulty in fixation but anyhow I will fix it firmly using glue so this way this device has been prepared and I'm going to put it in the 220 volt supply and you can see the red LEDs had been come and now I'm going to switch it to the green so here in the center there is off and this side it is red and this side it is green so this is a nice device had been created uh, 220 volt of course and this will take very little power uh, for as a night lamp for a room so whatever color you need you can switch it from here sometimes you need green sometimes you need red so we will switch it like this so now, now my tiny engineer is doing like that he is changing actually he is going to understand the function so it's like that and he is happy also with this small device <coughs> <laughs> okay so you are going to change this the colors you are going to change okay so now you are happy you are happy with that yeah yeah okay thank you very much so this was a small device just i created i hope you people enjoyed this video 
and uh, if you enjoyed it give us a big thumbs up and stay with stay tuned with my videos and subscribe my channel and also here downside you can see one uh, bell icon you must click on that